Thank you all for joining us today for another exciting round of this championship season. With top speeds of around 210 miles per hour heading into the overtaking opportunity of turn 13, the 2.7 miles of the circuit Gilles Villeneuve are some of the quickest on the Formula One calendar. There are 14 corners in total, with 60% of the lap taken at full throttle, and average lap speeds clock in at about 130 miles per hour. It's race day yet again, and joining me for a chat, Anthony Davidson. And our racers are certainly in for a rough day today. What will you be watching for as they go down into Turn 1? Well, the start of the race is always one of the most nerve-wracking parts. You have to hope that everyone is able to get off to a clean start, and this is possibly the trickiest part of the entire race. So many drivers in such a small space, and finding your breaking point into Turn 1 as well. It's a testament to the driver's skill that there aren't more incidents. Off the back of a fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks for today's race. A fantastic qualifying from Roman Grosjean yesterday puts him on pole, and Daniel Fiat lines up alongside. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Ricardo, Hulkenberg, Sebastian Vettel, and Bottas, Giovinazzi, Sainz, Verstappen, and Charles Leclerc, Norris, Hamilton, Sergio Perez, and Albon, Raikkonen, Magnussen, Pierre Gasly and George Russell, Kubica and Lance Stroll brings the grid to a close. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. OK, here we go. I know what you can do. Don't let me down.
harvest more energy. Take. This is your final lap, final lap of the race. See you in part for me. What a fantastic Grand Prix that was, and an excellent win for the Haas team. Tell me, Ant, how did they manage to achieve this win? Well, I think it was clear what the main contributing factor out on the track was today, speed. I know it sounds like an obvious thing to say, Crofty, but fast cars win races, and we saw that today with our winner. The quality and fantastic result of the Haas team will have been noticed by everyone else out there today. You can see why everyone's taking them so seriously. These drivers will be hot property by the end of the season. And now let's take a look at the driver's standings. Valtteri Bottas passes his rival to take over the lead of the Drivers' Championship. Some amazing talent out on the track today, but Anthony, who would you pick as your driver of the day? Well, my driver of the day has to be Charles Leclerc. He was unstoppable out on the track today, weaving through the competition with ease. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the Constructors' Championship. Mercedes continue to extend their lead. Meanwhile, Ferrari have improved their position. A strong weekend from them as they fight their way towards the top. Well, Ants, an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one.